What's up guys, that racing game guy here back in spin tires. Today I'm back on the beautiful map and I am testing out this 94YJ with an absolutely insane lift. Like the long arm kit on this thing is bigger than the Jeep itself. So yeah. Um <laughs> Let's see what this thing can do. The dang it, I hate the camera in this game. The the little screenshots in the Steam Workshop, they looked pretty good. The camera is really messed up on this thing. Hmm. Strange. You can't even dang it, you can't even really see it that well. Oh, come on, don't. It wasn't like that to begin with. Let me, uh, let me restart real quick. Go back to the main menu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Play. I'm just gonna go through here and, like, redo that. That way it sets me in a new game. Not sure. What? That's not the map I tried to load. There we go. Okay, where'd it go? There it is. Yes. Yes, I do. Okay. Maybe this time it'll be better. Yeah, okay, it's working now. I'm not sure... What happened a minute ago? I guess I uh, had glitched, glitched it out. But anyway, like I was saying, the lift on this thing is absolutely insane. The lift is bigger than the actual Jeep. And the screenshots of it look like it can flex like nobody's business. Which I may actually be on the wrong map to be able to push this thing to its fullest potential. Let's just go down wherever. Screw the road. No one needs the road. Ooh, a little bit of drift there. <laughs> Funny. Alright, let's get some gas. What is that? Oh, old farm truck. Nothing I'm very interested in. Jeez, what a turning radius. <laughs> what a turning radius. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. And I guarantee you there is going to be absolutely nothing. Oh my gosh! No way! <laughs> no way! I was not expecting that. I had the snorkel covered and everything. Alright, this Jeep is okay. Alright, I am thoroughly impressed already. Not what I, well, not what I was expecting, and yet it can't stand up to a little bit of mud. <laughs> SMH. <laughs> Let's see. Jeez, did they put enough lumber in here? One of these days, I want to use spin tires for what it was originally made for: hauling logs. I've tried to figure it out before and I just could not figure out how. Well, 
All right, come on. <clears throat> come on. It's getting old now. Remove cloaking on the map. There we go. Now I can see, well, see a little bit more. That looks like some water there. Should be a good test for this thing. Even though I've already really tested it as far as I could possibly push this thing. As far as water is concerned. Really need to find a good area to test the flex. Oh yeah, this <laughs> this little pond is nothing. Alright, continuing on. See, I want to stay in the grass here. It's a little more solid. I know the Jeep can handle a muddy trail, but I would rather not waste the time right now. Trail goes right through the lake. I ain't even worried about it. This really is a nice map. It really is. Actually, I will go ahead and put the link for it in the description down below. That way you guys can have it really easily. You just have to download the 7-zip seven, seven file and download like WinZip or something like that and unzip it and go in the game. I can actually I should make a video on that how to how to add maps. But you just go in the game files, go to media, then go to levels and then copy and paste the two little files in there. One is like a, a DDM or S file or something like that. It's a little thumbnail icon for the, the map. And then the other one is the STG, I believe it's called, which is actually the coding for the map. But you just put those two files in the game files, and then they just appear in the game like that. It's super, super easy. Really wish I could mod Xbox games like Forza <laughs> like that. Cause that would be awesome. Cause then I could put like a 2012 Mustang GT body in there, and make my own car more accurately than a 2013 GT500 like I did the other day. All right, I hate cloaking. It's pointless and it's dumb. All right, I'm gonna go straight and go through the woods there. Cause this trail is kind of sucking. And I know this thing can easily fit through there. You know, I didn't even think to check and see if there were any mods available for this Jeep, like, like in the garage in the game. Let's go remove the last little bit of cloaking through the woods here. Alright, moving a little bit quicker now. Oh yeah, no problem at all. Whoops. No problem at all. That thing looks fun. That looks super fun. What is this? Whoa, that's creepy. I'm not used to seeing buildings and stuff like that in spin tires. I like it though, it's cool. It's sketchy. Especially with the big black thing right there. It just feels like something out of a horror movie. Come on, why is it moving so slow? Oh, because this isn't a road, it's just a mud hole. Nice. Nice. Cloaking removed. Ah, yeah, I see the buildings now. Oh, there's a garage right there. Cool. <laughs> I... 
just drove right by that and didn't even see it. Alright, let's go unlock this garage and see if there's any mods available for this Jeep. Because if I could get better tires for the mud, that'd be great. That'd be super great. What? Garage points. What are garage points? I thought it was like everything else where you just drive close to it and it unlocks it. Dang it. <laughs> Oh, okay, there's like cloaking all the way out to there. Jeez. See, that's where I started. Where's the cloaking for that? I guess maybe that one? Huh. What is the next closest cloaking to me? I guess it would be that one. I don't really feel like driving back that way. Oh well. Who needs it? Not me. Rather go explore these creepy buildings. Who is a ghost? These buildings look so old. They look cool though. I I don't even I guess is it supposed to be like apartments or a hotel or something? A hotel would be even creepier because you know how many horror movies take place in hotels? Haunted hotels. Stuff is scary. Well, and I guess the road continues on that way. I don't know if I really want to continue on further right now. The problem is if I don't and I restart, then I have to go back to the, here, across the map. Oh well. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Um, I've showed you guys a lot of the map. And I really, I feel like there's not much else to the map. But, maybe next time, actually, yeah, probably tomorrow or something, I will take this YJ on my better map that has big boulders and stuff, and I'll test its, like, I don't, wouldn't, don't know what to say. I'll test its rock crawling ability. I'll test its, like, hardcore off-roading ability. But, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you did, leave me a thumbs up, comment down below on what you think. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below. Thank you guys for watching.